Hey folks, how are you? This is Jim Miner, the homeowner advocate at Miner Known Associates here in Phoenix, Arizona. Hey, I'm getting folks that are asking me, uh, because they're hearing and watching these videos, uh, and you're hearing me talk about this front-end debt-to-income ratio of 31%. Let's explain that a little bit. First off, in order to get modification, you must have that debt-to-income ratio must be in excess of 31%. Let's get some numbers of this right away or we're going to lose everybody on this thing. Okay, let's say that your gross income, not net, gross income is $10,000 a month. All right, and your house payment is $3,500 a month. That's 35%. The bank needs to get that modified to at least 31%, which means that they have to get your house payment down to $3,100 and that's a reduction of $400. How did they we get to $3,100? Well, if you take 31% of $10,000, your gross income per month, 31% of that number is $3,100. That's where the bank has to get you in order for you to qualify for loan modification. That's module number one, okay? Now, if that number is already, let's say that you're earning $10,000 gross income and your house payment is $2,800 a month, then the odds of you getting loan modification is virtually nil, okay? You are already below 31%. What they're going to say is you just have bad budgeting. So for them to issue loan modification to you when you're already below 31 percent i can tell you folks the odds are you will never see loan modification okay but anyway that's what the 31 percent debt to income is and just a brief explanation on the actual number debt to income that $3,100 the $3,500 house payment i'm talking about that is your principal interest tax and insurance and if there's an HOA payment, okay? That's what they're looking at versus your gross income, okay? Hopefully that cleared it up. If you have any questions, give me a call at 602-345-0433. And this is Jim Miner, the homeowner advocate with Miner Known Associates here in Phoenix, Arizona. All right, you have a good day.